Hello everybody and welcome to our Tech Tuesday Tutorials number 17. Today we're looking at CopyDown, a Google spreadsheet add-on that lets you use formulas on form results. Collecting data from your forms is very handy and it's really nice that it dumps everything into a spreadsheet, but sometimes you'd like to do something with that data and you'd like to do it in real time so that you don't have to go back and copy paste some of that data into another spreadsheet to perform functions on it. An example of this would be, let's say that you are doing a form, and I'll show you the form that I'm using here, where you may be evaluating somebody, uh, or perhaps you're cataloging how many items you've purchased or something like that, or perhaps you're looking at approvals. We're going to take a look at each of these three and how it works. So let's say you want to evaluate someone on these four criteria. I can go in here and put in uh, an extra column whenever I fill out the form, the data will get dumped in here and it'll ignore this column. So let's say I wanted to do an average uh, rating. Well, I can put in a formula like normal. This, is, this seems pretty easily, right? So I can just do average of these cells. Great, so this gives me an average rating of 325. Well, what happens if I fill this out, right? What happens if I go in here and I, I do another one and I say, okay, this person was pretty good. Click these in, right? It dumps the data in there, but mm, doesn't work with the formulas. So any formulas I might have in there, like uh, total cost of widgets that I might have, or perhaps uh, when all three approvers uh, have approved, none of these formulas are gonna work for me. After the first one, I have to go in here and do it myself. Well, there's a, this wonderful add-on called Copy Down. You can go to add-ons and get add-ons and go to search here, copy down, and add this copy down, maybe one word, hold on. There we go, it's one word. And then you just add this add-on and then it becomes available here. Um, so you can go in here and choose copy down. Now I'm gonna go ahead and fill out these other formulas to show you what that work looks like. So hold on just a minute, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So I've got the formulas in here. This is a simple multiplication one, which is G2 times H2, this field times this one. The determine a total, no big deal, right? The next one's a little bit more complicated, and I'm just putting this up there for you guys, which basically checks to see if you've got three yeses in the approvals, and if you've got a no, and if they're all filled out. So this is a kind of a complex uh, formula, this is a super simple formula, and this is a super simple formula. What happens when people fill this out? It's just gonna put a new row, and it's not gonna do these formulas. Now we get to use add-ons here, and this one is called copy down. So we go and choose copy down, and go to copy down settings, and all we have to do here is just turn it on. And it's going to ask us what row is your formula in and which formulas on that row are the ones you want to use. Now, what's great is that I can come in here and paste these as values, which means they're not going to be pasted as a formula. It's just going to put the number, which means that if these values change, it will not update the, the value because it's just it's, it's a value. So instead of this being a, a formula, it's just gonna paste in 325. So sometimes you want that just to put in the value because you wanna calculate it once and you don't wanna keep calculating, but other times you want to keep calculating as you go. In the case of the approval, that's a big deal, right? In the case of the other ones, it's maybe not such a big deal because these values may not change. Uh, in this case, I'm gonna leave it because I want them to come in as a formula and I'll save settings. And, and that's it, that's the settings for copy down. Once this is done, I can come in here and do another response and let's see how this works out. I'm gonna do a four a four, a two, a three. I'm gonna have 34 widgets at 17.23 a piece. We will have an approval, yes, no, and yes, and submit. Let's take a look at the values here. They'll be coming in soon. So this pops in on a new row, and then after a few seconds, look at there, it drops in the values. Now I've got a missing row here because I cleared out a row, uh, so that would actually no not normally be there, so let's delete that row. But this successfully copied it down, and even better, copy down creates its own column here that says, hey, this is what happened. It copied down all the formats and formulas from row two. It does the, the, the colors and everything else and the formulas. So every time we get a new submission here, it's auto-calculating what we needed to calculate. All right, I hope this was useful for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you did like this, please hit that like button. And if you'd like to support us, please hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next week. Bye-bye.